if you have been constantly plagued by Facebook ads and their complexity and you just want something simple to get off the ground running and not not really get lost in, in the in the rabbit hole that is ads manager inside of inside of Meta or Facebook, then this training is for you. Uh, th- this right here is designed to show you how you can take you know this simple software inside of Go High Level and bolt on the ability to just run quick Facebook ads literally in just a matter of clicks. I would say maybe you know three or four clicks at the most. Um, this is this is a, a a solution that that I discovered and I tell you what that I have never seen anything like this. I had to see it for myself. And so uh, what we're going to do is be able to take you through the solution here. We're going to start and go high level, okay? Uh, we're going to start here and go high level, and then we'll move over to the bolt-on solution to show you what it looks like and how you can integrate it into go high level. And the software I'm talking about is called Uphex. Uphex is a third-party platform that allows you to um, seamlessly integrate and uh, combine with go high level the ability to run uh, Facebook ads and pay-per-click ads, a.k.a. Google ads. And so what I'm going to do is just take you right into this training and show you uh, there are some caveats and some conditions. Um, you, you do need to already have ownership or at least the ability to manage uh, an existing ad account and your existing Facebook page. You, you need those requirements. OK, you have to be able to have that created or uh have somebody walk you through creating that for you. Make sure that that's set up. And so, yeah, I'm not going to say you're, you're going to be completely without ads manager, but you do have to set up billing and payment. Uh, you do have to set up an ad account. So that has to exist, but the software will take you, you know, the software will take you through that. And what I've done is I, I've, um, I was able to use, uh, one of the, uh, one of the many features that they have to actually integrate into high level. So I'm going to move this out of the way. So you can see right here, I added this section right here and called it Simple Ads. <laughs> because it really is. I mean, for so long, and I don't know if you, you're with me on this, but um, in, in the past, maybe you had an agency that was charging, you know, 2000 3000 4000 5000 a month just to run Facebook ads because it was so complex, right? It, it was so convoluted. But what, you know, this software with Uphex and Go High Level, what they've done is they've completely eliminated all that complexity. Uh, so whenever you sign up for your Uphex account, they will give you a special uh, website link. Uh, you can get a 14-day free trial. Uh, there will be a link down below in the description to where you can check out Uphex for yourself. And if you find this for you, great. If not, no big deal, but um, I just wanted to actually include that so that way, if you want to get access to Uphex, you can actually click down below. And it is an I do have my it is an affiliate link. I do have that for a 14 day free trial. And then once you sign up for that free account and you go into its settings, it will give you a custom uh, URL to be able to embed into Go High Level and create this custom menu link that you see right here. Um, that That is an entirely separate uh, conversation. I actually have a separate training on that. I'll probably link that in the description as well to how you can add custom menu links inside of High Level because I have one here for Knowledge Base. And of course, right here is one for Simple Ads. So if I just click on this right here and I'm inside my account, right? I'm inside an account. Uh, you can't do this at the agency level. That has to be in, 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 in a sub account. And so I'm going to click right here into my sub account right here and as you can see um I'm, I'm in i'm in an empty account right here it's my it's like it's like my guinea pig account right i'm doing a lot of testing with this one and uh, my my business account and so like um i over here we have our integrations and you have to integrate first you have to be able to connect it to your facebook account first and your facebook page and then your ad account in that order and so it has to go through those layers of authentication so uh once you have making sure that all that prep's done first that doesn't really take too much time but if that's something you need help with get your facebook pros to uh work with you on that uh so uh go to integrations here and once it's integrated and you got green, green checks right here we're going to literally go to launch a new campaign that is this is it i'm going to go to launch a new campaign i'm going to choose my platform in this case facebook and then um i have i'm going to move my move my uh, self back over here um i added a couple of different a couple of different templates right and that's the thing is that uh what, what they've done what uphex has done is simply amazing is they've actually preloaded uh custom templates that you can use that have been proven they're already proven right you maybe you could probably change a little bit of the copy maybe change the image but for the most part it's set so for example let's say you are we're gonna go into home services okay we'll just go into that as, a, as an example okay uh, let me click on that. And so you, we got flooring, home repairs, house cleaning, landscaping, HVAC, pest control, 
uh, pressure washing, restoration, angle cleaning, security. So let's say it is plumbing. Let's let's say you're watching this on YouTube and you are you have a plumbing business. Uh, we're gonna go to plumbing copy, okay? And then we're gonna select our ad template. And I apologize for this being slow, but it's literally got the ad copy. Um, and these are the different examples of templates that you can use. And so like this is $99 drain cleaning, $99 drain cleaning special. Here's $55 off plumbing repair. Uh, these are, just, like I said, these are just templates. Um, you can uh, adjust these as you see fit. Excuse me. You don't literally have to go for this uh, line by line. Uh, so what we can do is so if water leak, home water, free home water test. Um, these are proven uh, ad copies. So let's say we wanted to just... We wanted to preview it, right? So I'm going to click on preview. And then I can see what the ad will look like. Uh, my internet's being slow for whatever reason. Uh, but um, there, there is a graphic here. Um, there is actually a couple of different graphics. So let me actually go up to one that is already. So let me look at this one, okay? I'm going to click on that one. And then, well, that'll actually take <laughs> that'll take you right to the campaign details. Uh, so let me, let me go back. Let me go back to the ad templates, okay? Let me go back and, and I'm going to preview this. And then I can see what this ad looks like. So let's say it's this one, right? Let's say we want we want to do this uh, this ad right here. Let's say we you are a plumber that offers fifty five dollars off for plumbing repairs. Okay, maybe that is you. Um, I'll show you guys how to edit. I'll show you guys how to go back in and you can edit all this so that way you can create your own or duplicate your own and make copies. And so let's just say I want to go with this ad. All right, let's say this is good. I do have a fifty five dollars off coupon for plumbing repairs. I'm gonna say select this ad. All right. This is just how, how uh, simple it is to launch an ad now, okay? Because you saw we picked our category, we picked our subcategory, and then we got our template, right? We got our ad templates. And then uh, what we're going to do is we're going to choose uh, campaign details, all right? So here's our template, our ad, my ad account, my Facebook page. You have to have all of these. Here's the campaign info. Uh, the campaign type, you can choose uh, Messenger for Leads Engagement. Uh, landing page or lead form. Uh, I recommend lead form because this will actually limit the amount of hops that your, you know, that anybody coming in and clicking the ad will have to do. And so I recommend a lead form. If you have a proven landing page that already converts, you can send people to a landing page or send people right to Messenger. But a lead form is great because what it's going to do is it's going to automatically populate from Facebook all of their contact information. It is an initial lead form. And then right here, set your daily budget. Let's say your daily budget is $10 to start out. Okay, you're just testing the waters, right? You're dipping your toes in. Set this to be whatever you like. I recommend $10, maybe $20. Some people may even set 40 or 50. And then right here, we want to set your website. And I'll do that. It could be any website. It could be a thank you page. Uh, it could be any one of those. And then, of course, a radius. This right here will use your location, right? This will use your location that's on your Facebook page, the 10 mile radius around that page. Um, and then you can hit launch. I'm not gonna hit launch campaign because I'm not gonna launch this campaign because it doesn't make sense. But I'm just doing this as an example, right? And then you just hit launch campaign and it's live. You, your, your campaign is live and it may take it may take some time for it to show up in your ads manager on Facebook, uh, maybe five, 10 minutes for it to show up, but then it'll go through and create that ad. Um, it maybe, maybe you are wanting, as an example, um, looking back at this radius, this radius right here, let's say you are servicing multiple states. Okay. Maybe, maybe you are, maybe you're in like a tri-state area or a dual state or like, you know, in St. Or I'm in St. Louis, you know, Illinois and Missouri. Um, obviously, you can select your radius depending on where you are, but maybe you want to, uh, maybe you want to target a completely different state. Maybe you're in, maybe you're in Arizona and you want to target Alabama for whatever reason. Just as an example, um, I'm not going to spend too much time in optional info because this is how you get in the weeds, and that defeats the purpose of simple ads. But you can actually come in here and expand and customize lead forms. And so what I would do is actually go to location right here. And so if you wanted to target a different state, so let's say I want to target Arizona. Maybe I want to, maybe I wanted to target Arizona, a 10 mile radius within Arizona. Maybe I want to pick a state or maybe pick a city. Maybe I pick Phoenix, Arizona. Let's see. Maybe or down, yeah, say maybe Phoenix, Arizona. So within a 10 mile radius of Phoenix, Arizona, 
it will target that ad. That ad will target that location. Uh, of course, if you leave any of this blank, it's going to use the address from your Facebook page. So that's the default is your Facebook page address. And what I'll do is I'm going to take that out, and then you can do by you can do by zip code also. So I can do I can do a zip code if I wanted to. Um, but yeah, I would say I wouldn't do country because I think that you know that would kind of defeat the purpose because you're trying to do local, which is kind of interesting that that's there. But of course, you can actually come in here and go into ad media, and you can launch this campaign. You can actually go in if you have you can use template media or you can upload. You know your video or an image if you have this so if you have your own uh, creative like maybe you wanted to test a video or you wanted to test your own photo which I recommend especially if it's not right and then of course right here we can change our text so let's say uh, free in home estimate for new customers so let's say maybe we wanted to do a free in home estimate for new customers and I say we welcome to all new customers Enjoy your first complimentary home uh, in home uh, bathroom plumbing demand on us. Just as an example, uh, call us now to uh, schedule your today so you can start repairing asap so right here this this is if we wanted to do if this plumbing company wanted to do an in-home estimate and we would do that right here so welcome to all new customers so if they maybe they wanted maybe this plumbing company wanted to run a campaign to attract new clients and you can you could run multiple campaigns right you're not just limited to one but right here you can actually say let's say this plumbing company uh was try, was new to the area and then wanted to get some in-home estimates for bathroom plumbing repairs right and so if you have a if you wanted to do a remodel on your bathroom or just a repair um you can i would be more specific i would literally be more specific with this but i just wanted to show you that you can you can change these things but i'm just going to say template media i'm gonna go back to this gonna let me change that okay template media and so right here is really nice because you can actually change you can change the uh image and this is up to four so we're gonna do four we're gonna do this okay we're gonna we're gonna choose these four right here, and then of course we have our ad text right here. I want to make sure that's good. Get your plumbing fixed today. Uh, privacy policy. You can use your own privacy policy link right there, and of course you can select uh, if you haven't set up a Facebook page. So I'm doing this from a new account, uh, so you can actually click here. It will literally take you to the place to set up that pixel, so that way you can do retargeting and tracking. Uh, that's a little bit more advanced, but really, all in all, you can in essence just start like just crude like. I don't know anything about, I know nothing about uh, Facebook ads. I know nothing about this. So let's see, we got name, we got a lead form, we can edit it. It's going to do a default. Because I think what it's going to do, it's, it's going to do name uh, right here. Uh, you can, you can like get, really get into, uh, you can get into uh, the specifics right here. But I, I believe by default, it is... Um, name address phone number i mean nothing nothing crazy it's very very entry level as far as a lead form uh it doesn't it doesn't ask for a lot of information and then once you're done and launch your campaign okay that's good then there's one more step that you guys will have to do if you're doing a lead form for facebook is you have to tell go high level to map those fields right because they have to exist so we have to come into our settings and then go come down to integrations and then go here to form fields mapping okay and then once once you're at once you have your lead form uh that it is live it will show up here all right it will actually show up here and then you can actually allow you to map the fields to the you know allow you to map certain fields like custom values which is what you want you want to be able to map the custom values and to to the facebook form field because it's not going to know right because it's going to bring those leads in and bring them into a, your crm here and go high level and you have to be able to track those and then you, you may have some automation set up to where you can do follow-up maybe you send them to a, a little bit more advanced of a qualification page or maybe you just send them right to your calendar so they can just book an appointment that that's that's the power of this but the, the idea was that i wanted to show you guys that the ability to run ads is very very powerful and then if we come over here to the software itself which 
again, you can get link in description down below. I'll also include, if you don't have Go High Level yet, I will also have a link to get uh, 14 days free trial at Go High Level uh, right, right inside the description there. Uh, so let's go over to back here to the software. As you can see, here is their here is their template library. This is their this is their built-in template library that you get whenever you do you sign up for this software. And of course, right here, if you're managing a bunch of clients, like right now I'm just managing me, <laughs> I'm using this account just as an example to manage, you're going to have a list of all your clients, right? Especially if they are sub if they are sub accounts in Go High Level and they've connected, you will see them here. And if you are the type that you're like, okay, I want the DIY approach. I want to run my own ads. Here you go. <laughs> we can do it right here. Uh, you, you can do this all yourself. And of course, you can see uh, the campaign logs. You can see every activity that they have run on that campaign. Like maybe they had, maybe they had changed their uh, daily budget. Maybe they, maybe your customer changed their daily budget from 10 to 20. It will show up here. Uh, maybe they ran another ad or maybe they had changed the creative. A anything that shows you any activity on that or it'll show up right here uh maybe they paused an ad maybe 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 the customer was not going to be around to be able to field calls and they decided to pause the ad you can pause the ad from right here inside of your campaign if you go into your campaigns you can and you can actually you can go back and do it from there too but you can actually go back and let's say my templates here you can actually go back into your into your campaign here and you can turn off you'll be able to go in here and turn off inside of the software those ads. So maybe you want to pause it for a length of time, or maybe it was a uh, there's a limited time promotion. Uh, you, you could have been a, um, a roofer that was offering, again, a free estimate, or a chiropractor that was offering a free adjustment for uh, Mother's Day. Maybe for all the moms, you know. I, I'm just thinking, what, whatever you're doing for the mom, you know, whatever you're, maybe you're running a limited time campaign, you can turn them on and off. You can toggle them from here, and then you can also come back here into the come back here into your dashboard. Since you can run everything from here anyway, you'll be able to run it from here. So uh, that was just a real quick uh, tutorial on um, the the simple uh, the the um, the new way that I have found. To be able to run Facebook ads, especially maybe you're not that savvy and you don't want to worry about ads because ads manager can be very convoluted. It can be very intimidating. Uh, you could click a wrong button. But having this software right here built into Go High Level, it, it solves a lot of those problems, right? It solves that complexity problem. It solves that tech issue. It solves uh, you can maybe even get rid of your agency. <laughs> you can get rid of your full blown agency and run these yourself, or you know ha have somebody run them. Maybe somebody run this for you, or just manage this for you. Uh, you can still run the ads yourself, but maybe you just want somebody just to check on it every now and then. You could even do that and save your save yourself some uh, save yourself some money, and not have to worry about having a full blown agency manage all of your ads anymore. You can do it all from here. Uh, so uh, thank you guys for checking out this short training. Uh, if you guys have any questions, I'll put my contact info in the description. And uh, get rocking on those ads, guys. Let's go.